how to calculate the p-value in Excel. The p-value is used in hypothesis testing to determine whether to accept or reject the null hypothesis. In Excel, there are two ways of uh, calculating the p-value. The first is to use the t.test function and the second is to use the data analysis tool. So first we will look at t.test. So I need to type in the function. In this example, I have two sets of data, the selling price and the kilometers driven. So I'll first select the selling price as the first array, comma, select the kilometers driven as the second one, comma, choose one uh, for one tailed and then one again for paired, close brackets and press enter. And I have the p-value displayed here. Now the second way is to use the data analysis tool. Under the data menu, there will be a data analysis button. If this button is not displayed, you need to enable it by going to File, Options, go to Add-ins, under Manage Excel Add-ins, say Go, and tick the Analysis Toolpad if this is disabled. Since this is already enabled, I'm just going to cancel that. So I then click the Data Analysis button, go to T-Test, Paired to Sample for Mains, and say OK. Now here I can enter the parameters. So I enter the selling price as the first uh, range, then the kilometers driven as the second range. Now for the output range, I want it displayed on the same sheet. So I select that and go to the select a location on the same sheet. And now I say OK. So this does the test and dis uh, displays all the summary results. I can go and check the value for P value for one tail, which is the same as the uh, value that I got for t-test. Just to ensure that, I'll just copy the same format because this is, of course, is, um, uh, format is different. Select this on home, select format painter and apply it to this. And I see the values are the same. So this is how to calculate the p-value in Excel. Please read the appended article for more information.